Hey, Steve and all Supernatural fans. It's been a long time for a video. Uh, I promised you over the week that we would uh, get you a video on showing what is being done to your car. Uh, so right now, the car is jacked up. Uh, let me kind of come down here. Steve and show you rear end. It's been painted uh, all new shocks and springs, bushings, all that's in, waiting on the hand hard bar to come in. Uh, and that's supposed to be in this Tuesday. Uh, interior. So this is what it's looking like right now. The dash is all done, uh, waiting on a dash cover to come in. And then that little box up there on the dash, that is actually the brand new chrome vent uh, air conditioning or balls that go into your dash here. So remember this dash did not have the center vent in it and it did not have the lower vents in the dash because this was a non-AC car. So it has now been made to look like an air conditioned car. I still have to wrap your steering wheel. And then the uh, headliner has been all dyed. I don't know if you can tell the lighting here is kind of a little crappy. And then we have your uh, speakers and packet tray all done. Uh, so that's all there. Then the floor will get it all clean. And we've got the uh, sound deadener, uh, which will all go down here, all that new sound deadener. And then this right here is the um, AC box, or I call it the suitcase. And uh, that is going to go bolted up out on the firewall. So that's been modified and everything to fit on a non-AC car. Now the AC and stuff will not work in this car. It's just all for look, so that way when somebody looks at it, they go, oh, you got an air-conditioned car. And you can say, yeah, sure, sure I do. So out here, um, I think the guys have painted the inner fender well here, but this piece, so let me come over here real quick. This piece right here is the inner fender well. And as you can see, it, here's an air, uh, a radiator hose, but how it comes down underneath here, well, on the passenger side, your battery tray sits right here, and that battery exploded and ate all this out here. So that's why we had to get a new uh, fender well for this side. And I think, like I said, I think the guys have got it painted and stuff now. And then over here is where the, um, the air conditioning suitcase will go on here. There is, uh, let me come down here, the disc brakes all set up. This is the uh, tubular suspension, A-arm suspension. So the way we build them, that way it uh, handles really nice. This is a brand new uh, 454 engine, 400 horse, and uh, your exhaust manifolds have all been uh, ceramic coated. So that's what we give them a I keep that nice look for a long time instead of turning all rusty and stuff. Uh, as you can see, down here we've got new transmission lines coming out. And then, uh, this, is a, this is not show correct, but this is how I do them because I don't like things getting tangled up. But uh, the wires here and the plug wire looms, uh, it keeps it all nice and out of the way. And really, I mean, to me that's just so when you're looking at it from here and you open your hood they're all tucked out of the way instead of all laying across your uh, valve cover and stuff so uh, there's your carburetor that's the big uh holly on it your uh hei it's been converted uh the wiring harness has come in or not come in it's been ordered uh, so we'll have going into the corner lights because this car did not have corner lights on it and then we got rid of the external voltage regulator which is usually mounted up right over in here and uh, we went with a one wire alternator and this is the same thing that the show did so we're going to make all that you know just just like the show and it's actually going to run better and then of course your, your disc brake setup master cylinder and uh, power booster and all the thing there um, it's kind of tight in here where we have her wedged in, but 
the other fender's on, and if, you, if the car the car is actually real dusty and it's going to look real uh, dull and stuff, and that's just because the car has been wet sanded and everything, and then Don will come in doing his favorite job polishing this big big aircraft carrier. So um, we got a lot of parts that are on the way. Uh, in fact, they're supposed to be coming in next week. And then actually your new radiator is in the uh, office. Uh, we actually had ordered the radiator some time ago. And when we went to open it up, they sent us the wrong radiator. And so I contacted them. They just sent them, they just came in today. So, and then here is the uh, radiator spacer uh, that we had to find because the other one was like literally about probably about that wide and uh and then of course we got it down here to the thin one the way it's supposed to be so uh and then here's your flex fan sitting over here uh, god knows what there's parts everywhere but um so basically we'll get the inner fender well put on get the other fender put on and we'll get the pan hard put put on the, we'll get all this buttoned up here, the air cleaner, the uh, fan, the radiator, and all this stuff. Uh, we got a new battery tray because the other, obviously the other one was eaten up because uh, it had uh, eaten up the wheel well and everything. And get all this buttoned up, get the hood on it. Uh, we'll get a new windshield coming out here. This is just a windshield that we put in it. Uh, it was an old one. It was not your original, but it just kind of kept stuff from... Uh, getting inside the car and stuff so uh, like I said we'll put the new dash and all that stuff on here real soon so really this thing will be buttoning up here real soon so uh, I'm going to uh, let you go oh and then here is the uh, devil strap uh, done by my friend Rihanna who just knocks these out of the car so and then your uh, floor here will get us all this uh, an undercoating spray on it and everything like that so and I know that you're not going with the weapons box or anything like that but we'll make it look all nice and everything so and then kind of give you a shot down the, the pipe here it's sitting over here next to a 71 Chevelle so uh, waiting on the pan head bar and uh, pan hard bar and a few other little things but then like I said everything's ordered and uh, we'll be getting everything all put back together for you here real soon so there you go, Steve. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have questions, obviously you know how to get a hold of me. Talk to you later. Bye.